Hello everybody, I got here is three black plus decker batteries. As you can see, we're getting a red flashing light, which means it's not charging because because there's not enough uh, power here for the charger to charge it. Alright, so what I'm going to do is try to revive them. I got here is a Boston brand, an 18 volt. So all these three are all 20 volt lithium battery. So I'm going to see if I can charge, use, re reset this or uh, revive them using this battery. So let's measure the voltage. I got here in my, my uh, multimeter and measure the volt negative here put it on BCD 200 that's oh, that's making enough con good contact there 20.4 volts this one here I already measured this earlier and this one had 9.9 volts yeah right there and this one has this one's completely dead yeah this one's zero so I'm gonna mark it zero I marked this one by the way this is dead and this one has One dead too. This one has 5.6 volts. So 5.6. Let's measure this zero over here again. Yeah, pretty dead. So this one I might not be able to revive this zero one. So I'm gonna do that last. This two I'm gonna revive this. Try to revive this. So what we need to do is hook up the negative to negative, positive to positive. Gonna get some wire to put in between them. All right. So, all right. So here is my. I'm gonna use this as a jumper wire. So I'm gonna put negative. Uh, make sure it's positive. Positive. Go in there. Positive, positive. Negative. Negative. So positive, positive, negative, negative. Go in there. Okay, let's wait like a minute or so. All right, so it's almost it's been over a minute or so. Let's see if it does uh, fix that issue. Don't let them touch. Don't let the wire touch. Let's see. This is the one with 0 0.9 volt. And use my multimeter. Let's see if it changes anything. Or well, maybe just killed it. Now it's 16.8. Let's see. You see, I put 0 0.9. Let's see if it does help. It's blinking green. Try this one. Negative, negative, positive, positive. So we're going to wait another minute or so. So awesome. Huh? Look, it's blinking green. It's charging. This is the one with the 5.6 volts. And the last one we're going to do is this zero one here. Let's see if we can revive this completely. This is pretty dead.
Should I pause it like the other one or just wait? I'll, I'll pause it that way you don't have to keep it staring at the green blinking light. Alright, so it's about a minute. Let's take this out. Uh, should I measure the bolt? Uh, why not? Before we start, might that be enough? Ah, oh, you didn't get charged there. Maybe this one doesn't have any more power. Let's see. Still got 19 volts left. Let's try that again, but wait, do it a little bit longer. wait a little longer so all right it's been about five minutes let's see if we did get charged yeah hello what's going on still showing 5.6 what happened there Maybe it just doesn't want to get charged anymore. Yeah, it's still going red. Maybe just this one just dead too. What about this one? The zero one. Could be the I didn't connect it wrong. I mean I did it. Uh maybe this was loose. I don't know, but I'll try with a zero one. Let's snap. So it's pretty tight. Let's see if this zero uh, one will work. I don't know what happened to this one. This one had lower uh, charge and it, look, it c came up. Maybe I need to recharge this one because the volt was low already. Still 19. I'll charge that one first. Uh, so if this one that still doesn't work, I'll charge this battery first before trying it again with that 5.6 volt one. Well, okay, I charge it for uh, over 10 minutes now. This is the one with the zero voltage. Let's see. Let's see if we uh, revived it or not. It's still dead so this one's completely dead now I'm gonna charge this one because maybe there's not enough uh, voltage here so maybe I got discharged when I charged that one so I'll charge this one first and try again with this one so which one is one took up to all right so this one's charging now I'm gonna once this completely charged then I'll try to revive this one the 5.6 and I might even try the zero one okay alrighty let's try this again my this battery is fully charged let's see it should be at least around 20 volts Hopefully the camera can see it. Yeah, 20.3 volts. So this is fully charged. Where's the 5.6? This is the 5.6 one. Let's try that again. Positive. Positive, positive. Negative. Yeah. Come on, go in there. 
negative, negative. All right, so let's see if it's flowing. Yeah, it's flowing through here. Yeah, there's 20.3 here, so let's see. I'll give it about a minute. Uh, so, all right, it's been over a minute. Hopefully, get charged. Let's see. Measure it first. No, I think this battery is dead. Yes, it's still measuring 5.6. Yeah, all right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wait for this one to go get completely charged and try it with this to see if it uh, revives it because uh, these guys are dead. I'm pretty sure they're dead. All right, everyone, look. It's finally solid green. Let's see how much voltage this is on. Look. Oops, almost got the wrong way again. Look. 20.4 volts. So this is now a good battery. Now, the, this is the 5.6 earlier that we couldn't charge so let's try it again using the this battery to revive this battery see if it works now nah, I'm gonna do it this way so. negative to negative Positive to positive. All right, so it's been over a minute. See if they get charged or not. Let's check this again, make sure it didn't kill it. But the one that's we presume that's already dead, dead, and and it's still dead, dead. See, so this is pretty dead. It's still five point six. Now let's try the zero one. Probably not going to do anything either. All right, this is the one with the zero percent. I'm pretty sure it's not gonna do anything. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's dead, dead. Like this one here. There was one, this one was the 5.6. And if we uh, 
put it in the charger, it should be blinking red. Yeah, right here, it's blinking red because it's dead. It's kind of weird. This one only had 0.9 and it completely charged. This one, nope. Let's see if this thing charged just now. The zero. And I doubt it. It's going to be dead. Dead. Alright, so out of the three batteries, we're able to revive one. So if you have uh, uh, dead batteries, uh, you possibly could revive them. And mine is two out of three. Two are is pretty dead. You probably could open this one and check the batteries inside. There should be five batteries inside. I'm not gonna waste my time doing that because each sells. I think cost like three bucks. And if you buy a generic one, it's like two four thirty or something. My my it's much cheaper to buy a ge the battery, a generic one than than buying opening this up and taking out checking out each cells it's a lot takes a lot of time effort you gotta desolder it all that stuff so might as well just buy a, another battery a generic one should be fine in fact I'm ordering a generic one and uh, I'll, I'll test it I'll do an unboxing and a test on it and I'll put it online on my channel alright so that's how you uh, revive a battery that's blinking red like this. So out of the three, only one is good. This one. All right, that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope this helped. I see you next time. Goodbye. Have a nice day. Bye bye.